Hey, we're Water Parks. I'm Baby. We're talking songs. I'm gonna I'm gonna make sure the R is facing the camera too, so it stays on brand. Cause it was like this. Oh, and this is four track history. <laughs> Crave. Crave's a good song. Um, it was uh, from the 2016 EP Cluster. Uh, sorry, 2016 EP Cluster. Um, critically acclaimed, platinum in Brazil, diamond everywhere else. Um, so that song was actually written. A, it was it's like a breakupy song, but it wasn't mine. It was Jeff's. He just like told me what was up, and I was like, "Yo, I'll make this a song." And so. Um, we're in my room in Houston, and this is before all the cool shit was happening. This is before, yeah. It's yeah. like it was or like early 2015. Um, that was actually one of the ones where I keep looking at you because I'm used to talking to people. Sorry. <laughs> um, that was one of the ones where when we finally played it for the Maddens, they were like, "Oh, you guys don't even like need co-writes." And I was like, "That's right." Cause like we, so yeah, we, we, cause we had to go out to LA and they're like, yeah, let's try a bunch of writing things. You can work with different producers, see if you like it. Didn't yeah. like it. Um, and so we played them a couple demos. We played them that territory and Matt all the time. And they were just like, oh my God, you don't, you don't know. <laughs> they're like, you don't need these co-writes. I was like, oh, good. Let's cancel those. Yeah. And so we just got to we make got to start recording. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> For the music video, we just wanted to be dogs. I just wanted to be good old boys for a day yeah like that's how, to romp and play. that's how it was like before we were just like what do we want to pretend to be for a day a boy band okay i mean we don't have to pretend it was now, like, but. yeah and that was the first video we had yeah, people that were helping us put oh, it together yeah, there's a makeup person there yeah so that was put spots on our everything eyes. was exciting <laughs> um but uh like spots like the dalmatians spots. yeah <laughs> um and uh yeah so we got we just wanted to pretend we wanted to be at a dog show and like play with dogs and someone would give us money to do that granted not very much money but some enough. <laughs> it's stupid for you. It's feeling cute. Um, actually, that was the last song written before we recorded Double Dare. Yeah. Um, and it wound up being the the biggest one. So there you go. They always say that's how it goes. Yeah. But like, I'm always like. Okay, like you think it's just like one of those stupid things people say, but it's true. Like my mom liked that one the best when I played it for her. Yeah, my parents too. They were like, they were like, hey, like my my dad brought my mom upstairs because I was living at, I was still living at home, <laughs> I and <remember> um, that. <laughs> and he was like, hey, that one you're playing sounds really good, and I was like, oh yeah, and he's like, yeah, I played it for him, and I did, and he was like, wow, that's really good. So he went and got my mom, <laughs> wow. and I was like, y'all, this is weird, um, because <laughs> the demo doesn't even sound like as good. Listen, because like I was extra shitty at recording back then. Hang on. I'll play it for you. I got that demo on here. <laughs> uh, yeah, but that all yeah, our parents were just like stoked as fuck. So I was like, well, okay. And then oh yeah, and then the Maddens heard it and they're just like, fuck. Well, that one's going on the album. Yeah, yeah, like I guess it'll make the album. <laughs> Wait, which demos <laughs> uh, was it? This yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because all the demos sound more awkward because I'd never practiced or anything. I was just like singing it. Like, this drum sound like shit. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't listened to this in so long. Yeah. Uh. Tell me what you want me to see. Yeah. <laughs> the four sounds so awkward. <laughs> Blonde. Track um, three. Blonde. Blonde. Three. Blonde. Track. Blonde. The third. Track, track three of our four on entertainment. Four tracks. Those tracks. Track. It was the third track out of the ten. Uh, if you listen in reverse, it's the seventh track. Don't do that. Um, <laughs> it's um, it's uh, fast. It shouldn't be funny. Good. 
Um, it w the lyrics were a combination of four different sets of like there's four different songs that I wrote pretty much about the same thing uh, I was really tired of being on tour uh, we just started kind of you know people started figuring out who we were and shit and it was a weird thing to try and get used to and I really wanted to go home I was so sick um, it was it was like early 2017 we had just done our first headliner straight into the all-time low like full UK Europe tour and yeah. then we were going to go straight on to a good Charlotte Canada tour. I was just like, I can't do this. I'm going to die, I think. And so um, yeah, we canceled. Was... This is the only tour we've ever like confirmed and then canceled was good Charlotte in Canada. Yeah. Um, I was like, we just couldn't do it. I was so sick. Um, like literally auto sang one of our sets on that tour. I was so sick. Yeah. You, that's when we met y'all for the first yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. We were all dead in, in this upstairs in the, yeah, room. Yeah, in the green room. Like, they're like, this is rock yeah. sound. And we're like, ooh. <laughs> okay. Yeah. But, uh. That's that was bad. That was like the most sick of. I wanted. I was awful. Um, Lots of history in this building. <laughs> oh yeah, and people kept coming up that day. Where, like I couldn't speak, and they're like, "This is the big one." And then they'd walk away. I was like, "Or like a lot of people out there tonight." And like, who let you in? Yeah, yeah, it was awful. Um, where and, did you um, come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from? Cotton Eye Joe. So then we canceled the uh, Good Charlotte Canadian one. Went home, and that's when the demos for 1111, Blonde, Not Warriors, and I think Lucky People happened. Mm. So that two-week period, like, and if we didn't do that, we would have gone straight into recording without those songs. Yeah. Yeah, so that would have been fucked. But anyway, Blonde, sorry, was written. Uh, it was like four different things, and then that demo was coming together, and I just kept pulling pieces from dif those different songs. They were just about the same thing, so I was dealing with the same shit at that time. So it was all just kind of comp compiled into Blonde. Turbulent. 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 I like how you say it. Get used to that this week. Oh, <laughs> this week. Yeah. yeah. Turbulent. It's turbulent. Um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay, so, um, yeah, I was like, I'm done writing breakup songs. And then I got re mad about some shit. Um, my bad. And um, <laughs> honestly, the lyrics were done in like 10 or 15 minutes. I uh, just looped the. And uh, I was just like, just leave it on the loop. And um, it was, yeah, the layers were done fast because I, I, the anger came up and I was just like, Rawr! and then, yeah, I just laid down the vocals that night and that, it came together really quick. And like, I wanted it to be like a shorter one, but just have like a fucked up outro where like live everyone just like dies. <laughs> um, or like that second chorus where it's just like, I don't think. And like the, the storm sounds like, I was just like, oh, <laughs> oh man. Um, it took a minute to find the right storm sound. Um, because I was like, I was like, what the fuck is the point of putting out anything that remotely sounds like something we've done before? Like that's not a look. That's not tight at all. And it's super safe. Yeah. Like they, uh, like we had been, it had been suggested to us to do one that was more, kind yeah. of like in our norm, like our. Yeah. Done, I guess. Yeah. And it's just like, I don't, that, that, that's not exciting at all. I was like, Turbulent's going to fuck people up. I'm just saying. Yeah. And <laughs> then I leaked it. <laughs> and it went, like, it got like 250,000 streams, like, just on one of the tweets alone. Like, there's a bunch of re uploads of it, too. But I was just like, okay, this one's going to hit. I can tell. Mm. And, um, yeah, so then it just kind of happened. It got close to these festivals, and it was like, we need to do some new shit here because it's time like I don't want to be like entertainment's done and then like come back and just play the same shit yeah. it's like fuck that so um, yeah I was just like this one's gonna fuck people up I can tell and then yesterday everyone knew all the words the first time we played it it was crazy <laughs> it was deep yeah 